this weekend. The AB Dog. Right? We are just like the Barbados and the Awards. We are looking to see where we can develop new talent. And you know, the AB Dog would have made some impact when she performed at the Junior One Art Competition. So she will be now doing some social commentary and celebration kind of sort of thing. Next, we have, we would have got a little taste of him because we are again, again, trying where it is that talent is new and where it is that we can develop it. Mr. Wacky Bain, I call him the incredible Wacky Bain. He can ride on a bicycle with just one wheel. <laughs> okay, and he has balloons. He, he told me that adults love balloons. <laughs> so you can look up for Wacky Bain and he has been working on this song and you'll be hearing the entire song and seeing the entire act when you come into celebration time. And next we have another song that's a favorite of mine. See me and don't see me. See me and don't see me. <laughs> I have been practicing it on Saturday on the radio. Mr. Saul, I call him the acerbic Saul. And I like to mention, take some time out to mention my Facebook group because I'm very big when it comes to Facebook. That's why I have to bring it here to all of us. I want to make mention of the person who would have first brought my attention to Salt, and she is in the audience right now, because I got a Facebook message from Miss Terry Ann Pilgrim, who said that I should go on page two and listen to a song called See Me and Don't See Me. And I was like wondering why. I thought at first that somebody was dropping remarks at me. I thought at first that people were writing songs about me, and that was the song. So I went and I took a listen to the song and I said, yeah, Jerry, and that sounds like a nice song. And next thing you know, the song started to get popular, it started to dominate the airwaves. So I decided that I was going to take Jerry Ann's paint. And I had a conversation with Mr. Salt, and no Salt has been thrown <laughs> on the celebration time for this sort of thing. So we not only are going to be off this pepper, but we're also going to have some salt too as well. <laughs> and next, speaking of salt and pepper, we are moving on to a new person. I heard the song on the radio. I took one listen to the song and I said, this is a song that we should have in the tank. Mr. Gerard Ali and he will be singing as Chow Min, the first black Asian Chinaman executive chef. <laughs> chef. <laughs> and he's saying a song called the Chinese Connection. And Gerard Ali is from Lakhadopin. And not only is he from Lakhadopin, but he also has been making some impact as it relates to the international world. And so he'll be leaving Barbados to go and study acting professionally. So we would like to say that we are privileged that one of the last events that he should choose to. Participate in the celebration time. And this is the first time that he's actually making that step into the political world. So you can.